Okay, this is part three. We are now on Saturday last year after our vacation when Raider couldn't walk or move or anything and it was terrible. We rushed him to our vet. There was nothing they could do. Um, they gave him fluids and told me that all we could do was carry him three hours away, which took me three and a half, to uh, Mississippi State University. And that, they had a neurologist there, and I did. I carried him there. We jumped in the truck and uh, loaded him up, which it didn't matter because he couldn't move. And I, who y'all don't know, but I don't drive like that. Um, but I drove three and a half hours to carry this handsome man to Mississippi State University and dropped him off. He was there from Saturday, and I picked him up on Friday. They saved his life. We do not know. We thought he had a stroke. They said it was not a stroke. Um, he had what was called vestibular syndrome or vestibular disease. We did an MRI. We did the spinal tap. Everything came back negative, which was all in all good news. That means he does not have a tumor. Um, no meningitis. There is no reason why we don't, we will never figure out what happened to him last year, why he did that. Not a clue. But he stayed there. They saved his life. I brought him home. Um, some videos you can tell where his head will be turned sideways a little bit. And his right ear lots of times will be crooked. Um, they said that'll be lifelong. Um, when we got him home, he had a whole lot of trouble walking. But um, he finally got back. I think it took about three weeks, maybe four weeks before we finally got him back to where he was just about perfect. And since then, he's back to having one seizure about a month. He did go through a spell where he had a couple of, he had one um, eight hours, and in less than eight hours, he had another one. That's the only time that's ever happened. So we had to up his medicine. Oh, I guess I should say, we did finally put him on anti-seizure medicine back in July of last year, and he does really well. As you can tell, he actually had a seizure this past Saturday, but you'd never know. He lives his best life. Um, he is our handsomest man, and I, y'all, I know I've left a bunch out. It's very hard, but I know this is going to be nine minutes worth of stuff for y'all to watch. Please comment, um, DM me any questions or any advice anyone has. Um, he's very picky, won't eat cheese, won't eat peanut butter. Um, he chews his food. That's why it's very hard for me to get him to take his medicine because he spits his pills out. But thank you so much for listening. We love everybody. Thank you for the support. Love you from my pack. Bye.